Hey, what's going on, tech fans? Welcome back to Tech of Tomorrow. I'm Elric Ferris, your host. We bring you all the tech all the time. This week, we've got lots of great stuff. NVIDIA kicking ass in the mobile market and taking the crown home. We've got benchmarks and a full article on that. Also, HP once again enters the tablet market. Last time, they got their asses kicked. What's happening this time? And last up in the news, that's right, HP has sold their WebOS technology to LG, and we have that story as well. Right here behind me, you can see I've got a GTX 650 Ti, which I'll be giving away, so stay tuned and watch the end of the video. So right, folks, like I said, first up, NVIDIA Tegra 4. It's been released. At CES, they made the bold statement that they were gonna kick everybody's asses down the road, and right now, they have done that. Even the Exynos or the Qualcomm cannot keep up at this time, even though those people do, you know, have some things in the work that are coming out. But for right now, the Tegra 4 is the king of the ring in mobile technology. They are kicking ass. Over on our website, we have a full article and the benchmark. So if you guys want to see how fast it is against all that stuff, take a look over there. Also, next up in the news, HP once again enters the tablet market. Now, the first time they came out, they had one that ran an OS that was Web OS, which we're going to talk about a little bit more in just a second. And that one was a complete and total failure, and it ended up selling at a discount of the market for about 150 bucks. Now, I bought one. I actually currently still have it. I don't use it anymore. A friend of mine does when he comes over, but their original one to the market lost. Now, they're coming out with an Android version. It's going to be running 4.1.1. This is the version of Jelly Bean that's really popular right now. It's pretty much been stabilized out, no problems. These guys want to make sure that they're not making any mistakes. Now, all the features on this thing are pretty decent. It's going to come into market at about $169. Now, some people are really bitching, though, because the sound is basically the Beats by Dre audio solution. Now, a lot of people aren't liking this whatsoever. Most of the complaints I hear, they're saying, man, as soon as I saw that, I have no interest. So what do you guys think? I mean, at $169, it is coming in $30 less than like the Kindle Fire or the Google Nexus 7, but hmm, the features are kind of whack. I wanna hear what you guys have to say in the comments below. Let me hear about it. Now, last up on the news, in relation to the previous thing we just talked about, obviously, HP has now sold their web OS technology to LG. Now, they haven't sold everything off, just a lot of parts of it. And LG is going to now develop this and try to do some smart TV with it. Now, the people at LG, when they were approached and they were asked about this, they seemed a little unsure of the directions they were going to. In fact, the person who was being interviewed actually just stopped and was like, huh? So it seems like they're confused, but HP, they obviously know what they're doing. They're shuffling that shit off their plate, letting these guys develop it, collecting the cash, and washing their hands of something that for them was an entire fiasco, just like the Palm was. So pretty interesting stuff there. Hopefully we'll see LG do something with this and take advantage of it. For now, the WebOS seems kind of like it's just dead in the water. So I suppose you guys want to know about this card behind me. Not see you later. No, I'm just joking. Okay, you guys want to know how you can win this card? It's actually very, very easy. So far, I want to thank the people out there who have been following us on Twitter. Mr. Mike Fish, thank you very much. We're actually going to picture this guy winning his prize and getting it in the mail. He's a very happy camper. So what do you got to do to win? Well, all you have to do is follow us on Twitter and make sure that you tweet all of our news articles and reviews as they come out. Now, the really cool thing is you can enter as many times as you want. Just make sure that you use the hashtag, which we're all famous for here, of give me the card bitch. If you don't want to say give me the card bitch because you have some you know, strange reason you don't want to say that, then you can say, give me the card, please. I'll accept that for now. But you know, some people out there picky, you don't want to cuss me out, it's no problem, this is all done in jest and fun. Like usual, if you have missed anything at all and you want to make sure you get that information, make sure you check out the link in the description below. We will have everything going on that we've talked about in this video, including all the rules and regulations for entering the contest and giveaways. So with that said, I hope you folks like this video. If so, I'm not going to tell you what to do. You should know what to do by now. Make sure you're sub because we're always giving stuff away and having stuff going on here on Tech of Tomorrow. See you later.